Generating a local search grid report is way simpler and way cheaper than you think it is for your business. And it's a really valuable tool. So it's smart that you're here uh, trying to think about how your business ranks because that's key to attracting more customers in today's digital age. So let's dive right in. I'm gonna show you exactly how to generate a local search grid report for your business. And then you can even set it up so you get a recurring report once a month if you'd like. Let's jump right into it. Okay, so for anyone not familiar, this is the local search grid report. And basically what it tells you is where your business ranks based on where people are located on this node. So for this one, this is for a lumber yard and it's just lumber yards near me. You can see that their rankings are great and you probably want to know what is your ranking? Maybe for your store type, your business name or your products you sell or the services that you offer. Um, the best tool that I've found to do this is a tool called Bright Local. Um, it's really inexpensive and affordable. The rates kind of are different for each of their things, but we're talking about either using the free trial to generate this or being able to like generate a one-time report and just pay once or just sign up for um, a really inexpensive um, subscription where you can cancel any time too. So um, you can really make the most of this system um, to find out the search grid reports and play around for you. So basically this is this report, but let's just check it out for another business. So I'm just gonna add uh, my location. So that's what'll happen when you sign in here and I'll show you exactly how to set this up. So by the time you finish watching this couple minute video, you'll know exactly how to do this for your business. So I just click through, uh, make sure validate that's your business. When you do your sign up, um, you, you'll find your business. I'm not going to monitor all my data right now because I'm just interested in doing the search grid, but they do offer a ton of great tools for auditing your website, your Google business profile, um, your star rating, all of those types of things and giving you tools to get reviews and such as well. Um, but I'm just going to go right in here into the local search grid and then I'm going to click on get started. And it's super easy how it guides me through just monitor local search grid. And once I click on that, it's going to load a grid around my business. Now, the first thing you probably want to do, it defaults to meters. Um, depending on where you are or the system you use. If you're not on metric, um, I'm in the United States, so I'm gonna switch it over to miles. And then you can see that it's going to default to my store right here in the middle, but you can use this tool right here. And if you want, you can move the search grid around. So if you feel like you want to do that, you can. Um, so if you have like a service area that you service, it might be a good idea for service businesses. You might wanna be kind of targeting, let's say I'm, he I'm here um, outside of Denver. Let's say I want to really see how I rank in Denver, right? Um, you could do something like that. There's the general settings system where you can set this up to run weekly or monthly or just ad hoc. That means just run it once and see how you do. Then you can put the email addresses for where you want this to be sent to on a regular basis as well. And I'm gonna go right here and just put in the keywords that I'm interested in. So I'm gonna jump in and this is a lumber yard. So let's go over here and let's search for Front Range Lumber Company. And let's just see some of the products. So they have um, their lumber yard. So let's just start with that. They probably wanna know how they do for lumber yard near me and then they have let's just see their products got a bunch of products in here let's just say hardwoods so we'll do hardwood lumber near me and again we got to imagine these customers on their mobile phone you know in any of these locations around a business and just looking for who sells the things that they're looking for let's see they also do hardware and paint so let's check those out as well paint store near me hardware store near me and then i usually do like five so let's just see if there's another thing we might might be interested in. They've got composite siding. So that could be something a contractor might be looking for. Okay, so we've got our keywords and all we have to do next is just go over here to create report. So I just click on create report and it's gonna take just a second, but then it'll tell me that it's generating. Okay, great. So now my report's generating. That's gonna take just a second and then it's going to um, populate for me. Okay, so now my report has generated and you can see as I scroll down here that for lumber yard near me, you can see my search results. So now you can see where I'm number one, where I'm number 10, right? As we get closer to Denver, I start falling off the rankings. As we get closer to my store, I'm ranking. But then in this less populated area too, um, my rankings for Lumberyard are still pretty good. You can switch between keywords right here. So you can see right here, there's a lot of work to do on Paint Store. We know they sell paint, but they don't rank well at all. So anybody searching there is not gonna see them for Paint Store, Hardware Store, Composite Siding. Good news is they're doing good for hardwood lumber near them as well. So you can see a lot of number one rankings and then they're still in the results, although you'd like to be in the top three, even as you get over here to the right to more populated areas. Um, with Bright Local, the local search grid will also tell you average ranking, backlinks, like how you're doing compared to your competitors in the area and show you exactly where those competitors are located too. If you wanna make edits, you just go up here and you can do edit the report and you can change your keywords. And then like I mentioned, you can, you can publish the report, download a PDF um, or set it up to run and email you on a recurring basis so you know how you're doing. 
website. So that's how you quickly and easily create local search grids for your business. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more great tips to grow your Google business profile, attract more customers and drive more leads in your local market for your business. Thanks for joining me today.